out of my way, Reggie. It's Reginald. Come on, criminals. Time to see the founder. Jesse and accomplices. You have committed acts of wanton and illegal building, something specifically forbidden by our laws. Explain yourself. This could still turn out okay. Are you kidding? She does not sound friendly. But I didn't know it was against the law when we started to build. We were stranded. What are we supposed to do? Ignorance won't get you any favors. Aiden told me all about you, Jesse. About how you're a tyrant back home. About how you and your Order of the Stone steal all the world's treasures for yourself. About how you're here to steal the Eversource from my city. A terrible act of treason. Listen, Founder, Aiden's a master manipulator. He'd say anything to get his hands on the Eversource. <laughs> Much like you would seem to be doing right now. Jesse, it's clear that you're the little ringleader. So how about you come with me? Um, okay. Uh, I guess we'll just wait here then. Tell me what you see. I don't see anything. It's just empty. Precisely. As you can see, nothing exists below us. Only the void. Resources. Every kind are incredibly precious. And when something falls, it is gone forever. It is why building only happens when I dictate it. People only receive materials when I allow it. Otherwise, we would collapse back into chaos. It is my duty to keep my people safe. And the only way I can do that is if our laws are obeyed. Well, yeah, but you've got the Eversource, right? Can't you just use that to make more materials? It is not that simple. <sighs> People act as though I want things to be this way. Allocating the limited resources. Risking my life every day. Wait, risking your life? Is the Eversource dangerous? More than you could know. I'll have you know that before I found the Eversource, this world was nothing more than a cluster of pathetic islands in the sky. I do this for my people. That is why I do what I do. But you don't need to do it alone. We could help you. We could work together. <sighs> Being the leader of this city, it is a tiring burden. Uh, but no, this is my city. These are my people. And it is my responsibility. I think I've heard quite enough. Good. Now that you're back, we can talk properly. Reginald, I've made my decision. While I'm not convinced that you are here to steal the Eversource, the fact remains that you constructed a bridge of dirt without authorization. That is why you and your companions are to be detained <gasps> until I can discern the full truth of the matter. Reginald, please remove them. Yes, ma'am. What? Oh, come on. I wanted to help you. Don't do this. I'm afraid this is the way it has to be. Sorry, outsiders. Founder's orders. No changing your mind now. You guys have some really fascinating stuff here. Hey, you already locked us up. Do you really need to confiscate our stuff, too? Well, it wouldn't be much of a jail if I let you keep your stuff. 
Oh, wow. What is this? That's fine? It's almost like dirt, but not. That's called sand. You've never seen sand before? Sand? Wow. What's it do? Are you kidding me? We are not going to explain sand to the guy locking us behind bars. I refuse. Well, whatever it does, it's going in the chest with everything else. <laughs> Nothing sadder than an unimportant man on the world's tiniest power trip. Hey, I don't have to take this. I'm in charge here. You're criminals. Aiden told everyone all about how horrible you are. <clears throat> he said that you burn down trees just for fun. That you steal all the world's treasures and hoard them for yourself. He also said that you tame wild animals just so you can make them chase innocent people. Oh, come on. You can't really believe all that, can you? If he really wanted you to not like us, he would have told you about the oh. weather. <laughs> Shut up, Ivor. <laughs> uh, well, it was a lot to take in. I suppose you don't seem that way now that I meet you. I'm sorry, but this is the way it has to be. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go help the Blaze Rods beef up security. I can't believe I'm taking orders from that sniveling little... <clears throat> Stay here. Don't cause any trouble. I'm sure you'll be very comfortable. Reginald, you've got to listen to me. Aiden's tricked the Founder so that he can steal the Eversource for himself. There's not much time. They're personal guests of the Founder, and sure, maybe I don't like them, but... I'm probably just being... Paranoid. Richie, think about it. They want you out of the way. They're upstairs, beefing up security with the founder while you're what? Down here, locking up prisoners? You're right. Well, I'm down here. Who knows what they're telling her? Uh, okay. Let's say you make a good point. And I'm not saying you do. But hypothetically, why would I, Captain of the Guard, let you, a criminal, out of that cell? I'll never know how you looked at them and thought, there are some upstanding citizens. Okay, maybe you don't like me very much, but tell me this. Who do you not like more, me or Aiden? The enemy of my enemy is my friend. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> okay, let's say I'm heading to the pantry to get you prisoners some bread. Do you, do you see where I'm going with this? Maybe you'll forget to lock the door? Please just get out of here. Get to the throne room and stop the blaze rods. Ha! Ah, nice work! Now, on to the Eversource. I understand wanting to stop the blaze rods, but you can't still really want to steal the Eversource, can you? I'm actually starting to have my doubts about taking the Eversource. These people really seem to depend on it. What? So you'd rather just hand it over to the blaze rods? It would be one thing if we were plundering a temple, but this? This is starting to feel like stealing. Maybe we can find the Founder and warn her? Yes, yes, an excellent plan. Throne room was back this way.
Well, here we are. Back in the throne room. Keep your voice down. We don't know if we're alone in here. I don't know. Looks deserted to me. <gasps> hey! Wait! Stop! Milo, easy! That's Jesse and Lucas! Jesse! I can't believe we found you! I can't believe you punched me! Ah, yes. I feel absolutely terrible about that. Let me assure you. I... I thought it was pretty funny. Petra, what in the world are you doing here? We were actually planning to break you out of jail, but... I guess you guys have that covered. Hello again, Jesse. It seems fate has destined our paths to cross once more. I had hoped this would be the case. This is all very nice and very sweet, but who the heck are you? Uh, maybe you should look at someone's face before blindly punching them next time? Pro tip. I am terribly sorry about that, friend. What are you doing here anyway? I don't see any inns that need keeping. In actuality, I'm the leader of a group that wants the same thing you do. It's a rebellion. It is a long story. In short, my people want to free the Eversource from the Founder's clutches so that everyone may use it. If Aiden and his blaze rods steal the Eversource, we'll just be trading one tyrant for another. And I won't allow that. Yeah, he's gotta be stopped. If we work together, we can find it first. I do like the idea of beating Aiden. Hey, if Petra says you're cool, that's all I need to hear. The Founder's secret entrance is supposed to be somewhere in this throne room. Yeah, there was a door here before with a minecart. Yeah, what happened to it? Just need to make something to activate that redstone circuit again. There's gotta be something in here we can use. Like a lever. If you can find one of those bad boys, we'll have that secret door open in a snap! What would Olivia say right now? Probably something like, Jesse, it looks like it doesn't have any power. How's it looking? Still looking like it needs power. Don't worry, I'll find the answer. Okay, I believe in you. Fall from the sky or something. See anyone? Not yet, but the acoustics are funky in this place, so it's hard to tell when people are coming. We shouldn't hang around. Got it. I'm glad you're okay, by the way. <laughs> Thanks, me too. Habits of the Enderman by Soren? Wow, how'd that get here? The rest are just inventory registries and legal information. Boring. Nothingness, I mean. There isn't like a potion or something that could help us, is there? That's not how potions work, Jesse. Although I should really look into that. Oh, uh, Jesse. Thank you, by the way, for getting arrested with me. No one's ever done anything like that for me before. Ah, oh, well, you're welcome, Ivor. Now go away! All of this opening up is making me grossly uncomfortable. Definitely regal, not bad. Jesse, what are you doing? Ha, <laughs> sorry. 